Welcome to Talking Points with Texas Bama, episode number five. And I gotta say, today has been a really, really good day. I found out that a little while ago that I will have my job back that I lost uh, when my father had a stroke back in July. And it wasn't anything on the company's part that I lost the job. It was basically with him having a stroke and then passing away and me having to come to grips with it and dealing with it over the last, you know, few months, you know, that caused my position to basically go away on top of the fact that the position at the store that I was working, you know, went away in itself because of the hours they had to cut and stuff like that. But on the bright side, I get to go back. It's a permanent position instead of seasonal. And I'll be able to get benefits, which means eventually I'll be able to get my teeth fixed, which means eventually after that, I may actually possibly do a face reveal. I'm not promising anything. I'm not going to say I will. I'm not going to say I won't. I'm just going to say that I'll be a lot happier. And I don't know if y'all can see that out there in the field, but there's a cat. Looks like it's fixing to go after a mouse or something. Just now noticed that it's, it's hunting. It's in prowling mode. Wonder if it's going to catch anything. I know it hears something. But anyway, I've already done two videos today where I've had, you know, a little praying mantis. I did a video where y'all met Cletus. And if y'all don't know how to spell that, that's C L E T U S. Cletus. I have a hard time pronouncing some words, basically, you know, being pretty much almost toothless. So, anyway. Just wanted to talk about what's been going on over the last week. You know, we had Thanksgiving last weekend, or last weekend, I'm sorry. We had Thanksgiving last week, which was, you know, Thursday. Done this video since then, as y'all can see out there. I've done a little bit of the, well, I've done a little, well, a little bit of the whole, um, getting the weeds down and I'll be getting them down a little bit better pretty soon. And the cat, don't, no, nope, the cat didn't catch anything. And of course, he used my yard as a litter box. He's just going to go on about his little, little merry way. And, get kitty. Hey. That's one thing about cats compared to dogs. Cats have their own personality where they just ignore you. Whereas a dog, you would have done that, it would come right to you. Anyway, let's see. Last week we had Thanksgiving. We had a pretty good Thanksgiving meal. Didn't have none of my family over because my mom and my stepdad, they actually went out to eat for the first time. Uh, on a Thanksgiving ever my brother lives probably about mm, 45 45 50 miles away from my mom I don't know what he was doing on Thanksgiving and my sister's out in Tennessee and I don't know what they were doing but she didn't come down and I'm without a vehicle so I wasn't able to get to my mom's and you know Maybe next year will be different. Maybe, you know, we'll all get together out here or preferably out here because I don't want to go back into the city. I just can't. I just do not want to go to the city at all. And just all I can say is nope, 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 nope. No city. Now, if they come out here, there's plenty of room to, you know, have some sort of get together. My sister used to do that when she was here, and 
So maybe now, if things keep going the way they're going, which is starting to look up, maybe things will turn around to where we can all get together again. I mean, we're not any of us getting any younger, that's for sure. And who knows? I mean, it would be nice to not only have my family here, but, you know, my girlfriend's family, you know, if they wanted to come and hang out with, you know, my mom and them, if they came down, have two different families all together here, we got enough room for it. Like I said, as you can see, we got plenty of room for it. It would be pretty nice. I'm not really a big old, uh, how would you say, crowd person, but you know, if it's family and all of us are all together and we're all eating and everything, I guess it'd be pretty decent. But who knows? I mean, that's a year away. A lot can change between now and then. I mean, this July, I didn't expect my dad to have a stroke and pass away in August. I, I mean, that was just completely caught, completely caught off guard because before my dad passed away over the last 10, 15 or more years, he always, every time I seen him, every single time I seen him, for that, for that many years, not kidding. He'd always say, well, I ain't got much time left. I ain't got much time left, you know, and evidently he knew something that the rest of us didn't and we just basically blew it off and, you know, it happened and now we live with it and we get by and yeah, I miss him. But anyway, you know, He's back home in Alabama now, and I'm out here enjoying this, or trying to enjoy this, you know, getting back on track now, trying to be happy, trying not to be so depressed anymore, which I have been. That's probably the reason that my videos have really sucked. I ain't gonna lie, my videos have really sucked, in my opinion, because of the simple fact that, uh, one, my voice is like really deep, I know that. And two, uh, I've had, you know, complaints from family members and of course my neighbor across the street saying that it puts them to sleep. Well, I'm sorry, but I just, I can't control my voice as far as the ups and downs and <clears throat> the pitches and the, the highs and the lows and stuff like that. I just, I'm trying to find a way to be able to do that. Basically trying to find that way to come out of my shell, so to speak. And I'm working on it very slowly, very, very slowly. Probably about as slow as that one video that I did of the snail. But, you know, it'll, if it comes, it comes. If it don't, you know, I'll get creative with something else and figure something out. But, you know, there again, today has been a great day. Today has been a really, really great day. Now, as long as no one else goes in the hospital, strokes out, or anything like that, I'll be fine. I'll be happy. I'll be back at work, be making money, and, you know, I'll end up with another vehicle, so I'll be able to get around and be even happier. My daughter can get back to work. My sons, if they get a job, I can help them out as far as where I haven't been able to for the last four months. And that's all I want to do. I just want to help out. I don't want to be cooped up anymore. I don't want to be stuck in one place anymore. You know, it'd be different if I had a vehicle like a tractor or a ride mower or something to ride along out there and just, you know, plow up, till up, or just do something. But here recently you know I just haven't wanted to do much of anything because I've been so depressed because I haven't been able to do what I want and being without a vehicle and of course my father passing away and not having the not having the that kind of job that you go to 
that you enjoy going to, it drags you down, and that's where I've been. I've been drugged down, like really drugged down. But, you know, as you see, I've started doing a little bit here and there, and I'll be doing a lot more now that things are looking up. And one thing I gotta do, I gotta straighten out that water hose. I gotta figure out where all the hose are and decide if I wanna replace it or if I wanna get some of that flex seal, cause that flex seal stuff, that stuff is good stuff. I use that a little bit on my chicken coop and it worked great. But anyway, let's see, Thanksgiving was all right. You know, even though we didn't have family down, the meal was dang good, you know. My daughter, she cooked all of it. You know, I didn't have my boys over, my three oldest boys, which I wish I would have had over, or I wish I could have went over there with them, but I didn't, and you know, they, this was the first year, I think, in a long time, a very long time, that I've been without them on Thanksgiving. Of course, they're grown men now, they're in their 20s, and well, my second youngest son's fist to be 20 next year. But the weekend, the weekend was pretty meh. I did a video, I think Saturday, of the stuff out there in the field, whatever's been going on out there in the field, I think. I did it Saturday. Sunday, I know I didn't do a video because Sunday it was raining, I believe. I'm pretty sure it was raining. If it wasn't raining, it was like really windy. And of course, yesterday I did a couple, couple or a few videos and showed that there's rabbits out there. I, I jumped a rabbit. I'm, I haven't rewatched the video to see if I actually got it on video, but I did jump a rabbit out there. And today, you know, there again, I did a video of a praying mantis which is probably the last praying mantis of the season. I did a video of, once again, showing Cletus, and hopefully Cletus will stay put this time. You can see him right here at the, right there, trying to hide. And um, yeah, all in all, I think it's been a pretty good week since the last time I did the talking points. But as you can see, you know, sun's going down, got clear skies, except for out there in the north, I think that's northwest. We may have, we may have some rain coming in, but if it does, you know, it ain't going to drag me down because everything's starting to look up. And when it's coming up on Christmas time, that's even better. Anyway, that's about it for this episode of Talking Points. I hope y'all enjoyed this one a lot better than y'all have the previous four, if y'all have made it this long. And I guess that's going to wrap it up. Anyway, if you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe if you'd like to. I still need about uh, between two and four more subscribers to hit uh, that 100 mark. And when I hit the 100 mark, I will do the whole chicken coop, chicken run video as far as from beginning from last year to right now and the current uh, future projects on it. Okay, I'll do a video from the past the way it was to the, fu to the present to the way it is now and I'll talk about the future plans for it. That's what I want to say and that's at 100 subscribers so if y'all if y'all think this these videos are getting any better you know hit the subscribe button you know share it with your friends on social media you know just help me out here anyway and uh i think that's about it if y'all want to support the channel hit that uh support button you know donations are always welcome they're not you know a must or anything and don't forget to visit texabaman.com you know the holiday season is here i have plenty of stuff on sale at my webpage on amazon for for amazon you know there's every, everything from outdoor stuff to holiday stuff to electronics you know just uh you know check it out texabaman.com and i guess that's about wraps it up 
Anyway, y'all have a good evening. Take care and God bless.